my first question to you precisely. Uh, what's the kind of potential that you're seeing from the Indian tourism sector? How do you foresee shaping it in the next five, ten years? I mean, you mentioned about how, forget about the Chinese story, but how the Indian outbound tourism is growing. Your quick thoughts on it. Yeah, I think, you know, if you look at the, the size and the scale of the market, it's a, it's a bigger market. Historically, it's grown at a higher compound average rate. Uh, and I think, you know, you have a, a, a very sizable burgeoning middle class here. They're looking for experiences. They're really? looking for travel opportunities. And mm -hmm. so they're looking at, you know, that immediate next destination, you know, mm -hmm. um, beyond just the, the, the border. So in that context, I do see a huge amount of potential. We've already seen mm -hmm. how the Indian travelers have transformed. Mm -hmm. um, the way kind of the, the, the way that the Indians travel, I think, kind of in larger group sizes. Mm -hmm. um, they're uh, quite kind of agnostic when it comes to certain destinations and they're looking for experiences. Mm. Um, so markets like Thailand have already started capitalizing on that, the markets mm. like the Maldives, mm -hmm. and we will certainly start, start to see the Indian traveler go kind of further, uh, further afield as well. Right. You mentioned about the investor sentiment, especially the last quarter, which saw probably the highest in the APAC region. Historically, it has been 10%. You said this was 14 How are the investors looking at this sector in the region at large and some uh, insights, if you could tell, on the Indian side as well? The, yeah. yeah, so the, the, the buyers are, that are out there are looking at the recovery that they're seeing in the sector. So mm -hmm. they're looking at you know, further growth and mm -hmm. being able to be part of that growth story. Yeah. When you look at kind of sectorally other themes, yeah. you know, the office sector, mm -hmm. because of all of the work from home types, you know, the, the, the fundamentals of the office sector, mm -hmm. except for a few nuances in the region, have mm -hmm. changed. Right. And you know, hospitality as an asset class is one mm -hmm. of the first to uh, suffer in, a, in the event of a downturn, but it's the mm -hmm. first to recover because of the way mm -hmm. rooms are leased on a daily basis. Basis. So we've right. seen that recovery, that mm. hockey stick recovery post-COVID. Mm. We're continuing to see further recovery. Mm. So investors, as part of a diversified pool, they mm. want to be part of that story. Now, India is very much that, that okay. theme as well. Um, total transaction volumes in India, we're estimating it to be around $420, $430 million this year. So mm. in the context of the regional APAC volumes of mm. 12 billion at 400 mm -hmm. million, it's still a relatively small market, but it's coming from a very small base okay. and it's growing. So India is very much capturing the attention mm. of investors. Mm -hmm. And certainly on my side and with my team, we're having a lot more quality conversations about the potential for the Indian business and Indian industry overall. Right. My last question to you, you know, BW Hotelier will be completing its 10 years in January, you know, next year. What are your thoughts on the platform as, you know, the one source destination for business leaders of this industry and, you know, how it keeps the conversation going in the community? Yeah, it's my first time being here and I'm really delighted to have been invited. Um, mm -hmm. I love the energy and mm -hmm. the excitement in the room. I mm -hmm. think there's a huge amount of passion and, and desire to succeed in that room that just that I just came out of. Uh, and I'm really grateful for BW Hotelier to be able to bring everyone in a forum to really talk about the issues, the challenges and the opportunities ahead for the Indian hospitality sector. Thank you so much for your my time. Pleasure. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Thank you.